Well, it's coming faster than you think. Mother's Day is coming real quick. And we're wondering, how are we gonna celebrate Mother's Day if we're locked in our homes? How are we gonna celebrate Mother's Day if my mom's on the other side of the country and I can't go see her? I get it, Mother's Day and Father's Day and all these days are very special. And they should be, because we're called by God to honor our father and mother, that our days may be long in the land and that the Lord your God is giving you. Now, we always think of this as a uh, call to children, but it's really a call to all of us. And maybe it's a call to us to honor those who are older than us by visiting somebody who's in a nursing home. You say, I can't do that. You can talk through the window. You can have the opportunity to drop off um, just small videos or you know, small gifts and things like that. To honor our parents is something that is even greater. It's to pass on the faith. And we want to be sure that as we're passing it on to our children, we're upholding it in ourselves. But also there's the opportunity then to turn to your parents maybe in this quarantine and give them something meaningful. You have the time to build it. You have the time to write it. You have the time to think about it. Is it a poem? Is it a video from you guys to them? Is it a photo montage? Is it some kind of letter that deeply uh, shows your care for one of your parents? Is it an opportunity for you just to spend out a few hours on a phone? If you're not worried about quarantine with your parents, is it a time just to go and walk because there's nobody out on the streets or whatever? Lots of opportunities here. Don't allow the quarantine to keep you from honoring your mother and your father. Uh, in fact, it's a great opportunity to do something simple, just a little bit right now that you've got a little bit of time.